Hello and welcome back my loyal subscribers to Divine Inspired Care. As always we are incredibly thankful for your continued support. This month we will be acknowledging several Cancer Awareness Month. Today we're peeling back layers on a truly intriguing topic. Ever found yourself pondering over the enigma that brain tumors present? Fundamentally brain tumors are abnormal growths of cells within or surrounding the brain. They could be primary originating in the brain itself or secondary, metastasizing from other parts of the body, such as a cell from a breast cancer tumor embarking on an unwelcome journey to the brain. An interesting fact is that contrary to popular belief, malignant brain tumors are actually quite rare. Statistically, you have a 1% chance of developing one in your lifetime. Despite their rarity, however, the impact of brain tumors is wide ranging, affecting not just the patients, but their families as well. Brain tumors aren't all the same, they come in two main types, benign and malignant. Benign tumors are non-cancerous growths, they don't spread to other parts of the brain or body and typically grow slowly. However, don't be fooled by the term benign. Despite not being cancerous, these tumors can still cause significant health issues, especially if they're located in sensitive areas of the brain. They can exert pressure on crucial brain structures, leading to a myriad of symptoms. On the other end of the spectrum we have malignant tumors. These are the cancerous ones, the ones that can invade and destroy surrounding brain tissue. Their ability to spread within the brain makes them a more direct threat. Understanding these differences is vital in grasping the complexity of brain tumors. How do doctors find out if someone has a brain tumor? Let's journey into the fascinating world of medical science, where advanced imaging studies serve as the cornerstone for detecting brain tumors. These tools, which include technologies like MRI and CT scans, allow doctors to peer into the brain, revealing masses that might be lurking within this complex organ. These scans can provide detailed images of the brain, highlighting any unusual growths that may suggest the presence of a tumor. But it's not just about what we see, it's also about what we feel. Symptoms associated with brain tumors can be as diverse as the individuals they affect, and they largely depend on the location and size of the tumor. For instance, imagine a tumor situated in the brain's speech area. This could manifest as difficulties with speech or comprehension, causing a person to struggle with words they've known all their life. Yet not all symptoms are so specific. Sometimes they're more subtle, more commonplace. Persistent headaches, for example, or bouts of nausea, perhaps even an unexplained confusion that seems to cloud the mind. These nonspecific symptoms might be easily dismissed or attributed to other causes, but in some cases, they can be the body's way of signaling the presence of a brain tumor. This is where the importance of a thorough medical evaluation comes into play. It's not enough to rely solely on symptoms or imaging studies. Doctors must also consider a person's medical history, perform physical and neurological exams, and sometimes even resort to biopsy, which involves taking a small sample of the tumor tissue for examination under a microscope. This journey to diagnosis can be a complex and challenging one, full of twists and turns. It requires the expertise of dedicated medical professionals, the resilience of the patient, and the unwavering support of loved ones. Your body has a unique way of telling you when something is wrong. When it comes to brain tumors, the symptoms can be as diverse as the individuals they affect. Depending on the size and location of the tumor, you might experience a variety of signs. Headaches that persist or intensify, particularly upon waking, can be one such indication. Nausea, vomiting, or unexplained changes in vision, speech, or hearing might also signal the presence of a brain tumor. More severe neurological symptoms, such as weakness or sensory loss on one side of the body, can also occur. Even subtle changes, like shifts in personality or mood, can be clues. It's important to remember that these symptoms don't automatically mean you have a brain tumor, as they can relate to many other health conditions. However, if these symptoms persist or can't be otherwise explained, don't ignore them. It's crucial to heed these warnings and seek medical advice if symptoms can't be otherwise explained. The treatment landscape for brain tumors has evolved significantly. Over the years, we have taken giant strides in refining our approach to treating these complex medical conditions, moving beyond the one-size-fits-all methods of the past. The advent of surgical intervention marked a significant milestone in our fight against brain tumors. Surgeons now have the ability to remove tumors with precision, minimizing damage to surrounding healthy brain tissue. Yet it's important to remember that surgical intervention is often just the first step in a multifaceted treatment plan. 
Radiation therapy has also been a key player in the treatment of brain tumors. It harnesses the power of high-energy particles to damage the DNA of cancer cells, inhibiting their ability to divide and grow. Radiation therapy can be delivered externally, targeting the tumor from outside the body or internally, where radioactive material is placed directly into or near the tumor. Chemotherapy, the use of drugs to kill cancer cells, is another mainstay in the treatment of brain tumors. These powerful medications can be administered orally, intravenously, or directly into the cerebrospinal fluid, reaching cancer cells wherever they may hide. Yet our quest for more effective treatment options doesn't stop there. In recent years, there's been a surge of interest in targeted therapies. These innovative treatments work by homing in on specific characteristics of cancer cells, leaving healthy cells largely unharmed. This precision makes targeted therapies potentially more effective and less harmful than traditional treatments. Immunotherapy, another exciting frontier, is beginning to reshape our understanding of how to combat brain tumors. By harnessing the body's own immune system, these treatments aim to boost natural defenses to fight the cancer. The promise of immunotherapy lies in its ability to offer a more personalized approach to treatment, tailored to the individual's unique immune response. In conclusion, the fight against brain tumors is far from over. But with every passing day, we edge closer to a future where these formidable foes can be effectively managed or even cured. Cutting-edge research is paving the way for more personalized and less invasive treatment options. Awareness and early detection are our most potent weapons against brain tumors. Although brain tumors are relatively rare, their impact on individuals and their families is profound. This is why raising awareness about this critical health issue is so essential. It's about more than just spreading information. It's about fostering understanding and empathy, about enabling early detection, and ultimately about saving lives. The earlier a brain tumor is detected, the better the chances of successful treatment and recovery. However, early detection hinges on our ability to recognize the signs and symptoms. Persistent headaches, nausea, confusion, speech difficulties, or unexplained neurological symptoms are all signals that something might be amiss. Remember, your body has a remarkable way of signaling when something isn't quite right. Don't ignore these signals. If you experience persistent or unexplained symptoms, seek medical help immediately. Knowledge empowers individuals to recognize potential symptoms and seek medical help. So stay informed and proactive about your health. Before we wrap up this enlightening journey through the enigma of brain tumors, we'd like to remind you to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more informative videos like this one. Every like, share, and subscription not only helps us to reach more people, but also plays a crucial role in raising awareness about brain tumors and other critical health issues. You're not just expanding your knowledge, you're potentially saving lives. The more people understand about brain tumors, the more they can do to protect themselves and others. Remember, knowledge is power, the power to recognize signs and symptoms, the power to seek early diagnosis, and the power to fight. Let's use this power to make a difference. Together, we can beat brain tumors. Until next time, goodbye.